here on the program. It's nice to have Mark Burnett on the program just to talk about the Bible because I know that's something that resonates with every single one of us out there because it's true. Um, no, because Mark Burnett's changed television. Right? He's changed television. What he did with Survivor and The Apprentice, and yes, it is kind of unfortunate that he brought Donald Trump back to the mainstream, but still, <laughs> we all know now what Donald really is. But, you know, Mark has changed television in a lot of different ways. And, you know, people from a certain generation will go, oh, back in the golden era, the golden era. The truth is we are living in the golden era of television, hands down, and that's what we're going to do tonight on Three Things. <laughs> Please welcome, as always, Ali Hassan is here. Pat Thornton is here. The special guest, Kate Davis, is here. Welcome to the show, everybody. Let's get back here on the Three Things panel. Kate Davis is hanging out with us. She's about playing some shows in February at Absolute Comedy. I think it's the 13th to the 17th, right? That's right. So Wednesday yeah. to the Sunday, go check her out. Pat, you're playing... Just around, I'm around. He's around. <laughs> <laughs> you just see me around. Uh, you? Can I, can I just be around you, Pat? Yeah, we're I'm going to be uh, around him. Around. When he's around, I'll also be this around. This is sort of the riveting television we've been talking about. <laughs> all, hey, hey, just floating around. We are talking about uh, TV, in, partly inspired because Mark Burnett, the very successful producer, was on this program. So if you were judges, how would you approach Like, Who would you advance to the next stage of a singing competition? Let's say you were judges, and it was President Barack Obama versus this nation's father, Prime Minister Stephen Harper. Who would go forward? I thought about this. I thought, at first I thought, you know, I want to advance Obama, but then, right. then I thought, <laughs> you know, why not encourage Stephen Harper to follow any career path that isn't politics? <laughs> He's with me, right? A slight minority of people who vote are with you. <laughs> the majority of voters are clearly not with I you. Play in the room. How about this one? Let's say you're a judge on Survivor, and on Survivor, <laughs> it comes down to Celine Dion and Jerry Seinfeld. Uh, Celine is from a small town in Quebec, and she is the youngest of 14 children. She is a survivor. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. How about this one here? So let's say it was a cooking show, right? And the cooking show pits, well, I suppose you can still call him a media baron, but Conrad Black versus leader of the Green Party, Elizabeth May. I, I, you know what? This is going to be a close one. It's going to be a tiebreaker because when Elizabeth May cooks, it's like her party. You want to try it, but you don't know what it is. 